Hello, 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 my sassy soul sisters and friends. Welcome back, Sassy here. And welcome to my first episode of Stacy Side Notes. And I really am not sure if I'm gonna keep it that name because <laughs> it's between that and Stacy speaking shiznit. But I won't always be speaking shiznit. <laughs> Just the truth. <laughs> um. But basically, I wanted to do like a different kind of vibe um, with unboxings. These are going to be random unboxings, not like my normal ones that I always get. Um, this will be my little mini hauls. This is where we can talk about past boxes, what I liked, what I didn't like. I was going to bring a bunch of products up that um, I've been loving from my Allure Beauty Box. But I think I'm going to keep beauty separate for now. We'll see, we'll see what happens. But I have lots of things. Um, I kinda wanted to go live so you guys could talk shit with me um, and tell me why did you buy that? Because I needed to. Because I literally have all these boxes to unbox and here I am going to Marshalls and buying unnecessary shit. I literally was in there for like 20 minutes talking myself out of not buying a blanket because I wanted this blanket so bad. It was so soft, it was purple and white and it was like checkered and it had these purple, it was like purple and white and it was whatever white had purple flowers and the white had, you know what I'm trying to say, it was opposite. And it was soft and I'm just like, do you need another blanket? And part of me was just like, hell yes, this thing is soft as shit and it's your favorite colors, why not? And the other part of me is like, you get enough blankets. And then the other part is me like, yeah, but when people sleep over and they bring their kids, you know, they only each get one blanket. Maybe they want more. And yeah. So I had to talk myself out of buying a $25 blanket. <laughs> but I still walked out of there with um, one, two, three, four bags. So maybe we'll do that first and we'll be like, why did I have to buy this? Um... I also have a box and I ripped off the top because I had planned on doing this earlier. I want to say this is from the same Etsy shop that, actually I don't know if it is. I don't, no, actually it's not. I lied. This is from a new Etsy shop. This is, um, I'm hoping, this is what I bought my nephew to send to him um, because his birthday was, is in Feb was in February, the beginning of February, the year of the dragon, and I bought him this dragon piece and then I had bought one for my sister and like a smaller version for them both to have so like because they're so far apart and they're close I was like oh you, you both will have the same matching dragon so if you ever feel like you need to connect you can hold your dragons I don't know I'm weird like that sometimes I think of the weirdest stuff I swear but yeah we're gonna actually open that one first because I want to see and I'm gonna start packing Oh, they packaged it so nicely. Like, it's in, like, pretty boxes all wrapped. Oh, I don't want to unwrap it, but I do. This is from Crystal De Luna. Crystal De Luna on Etsy. Yo. <laughs> Check out. I'm going to have to just slide one. I have to show you guys. I'm like, I just have to slide it. I feel like you guys are so far away today. <laughs> because my stupid table wow how cute is this box and look oh energy within us and i wasn't sure if i was gonna like this company because honestly i went on there because they were having this huge sale and i'm like looking where their um crystals were sourced and i didn't see china so i was happy about that um <laughs> but like some of the crystals were like super cheap because they were having this, I don't know if it was 40% off or something. I don't know, it was crazy. Oh, this is a lot smaller than what I thought. Oh no, this is actually mine. I'm glad I opened this box. So this I bought for me. Oh, they packaged it so nicely. So I bought myself three little towers. I think this cost me um, maybe 10 bucks, 12 bucks. And I believe I have Unikite, Jasper, and I forget what the other one is. Is it Red Carnelian or is it? So I have this Red Jasper little point, just a little cute mini points. And then I have maybe Rhodonite, 
Maybe that's what that is. I know my sister Disco will be like, that is blah, blah, blah. Or it could be dolomite. Because I actually just got a dolomite crystal. And I always forget what that one looks like. So this could actually be dolomite. I know for a fact this is unikite. Because that's the reason why I got it. Because I, unikite is one of my favorite stones. Ever since the witch box gave me a little piece of it. It's been like my favorite stone. And I love it. It's very grounding for me. So yeah, this is actually for me. My three little mini pillar um crystals crap now i don't know if that's hers or if i'm keeping that wrap and that was super cute or did i get this from a different what is this so i didn't order this and i'm guessing that they just i'm about to take my husband's phone and log into my etsy account actually i am gonna do that because usually I never have as well. Yeah, I definitely didn't order this because one, I don't order anything in gold. And two, I don't order anything evil eye really either. Um, besides like some pillows that I have. It is all knotted up and I don't have time for that. <laughs> but they gave me this little necklace, little evil eye necklace. I'm guessing as a thank you gift. I do see a sticker hanging that says thank you. This is gonna be a very crazy video. Cause y'all know, oh yeah, see, here's a sticker. Thank you, it just came off. So I'm guessing that's from them. Excuse me. Let's see if I can work an Android real quick. <laughs> um, yeah, all right. Cause I wanna see what I bought from this company. Cause I bought from two companies from Etsy and one I didn't get yet. All right. Where is even Google online? Oh my God. How do you guys deal with all these ads popping up? Etsy. Oh, I would have to know my login. Um, seriously? Oops, it would help if I put my right number in it. I'm not a robot. Sorry, guys. I just want to make sure because I don't want to. passwords no nope. all right well I don't know how to sign in I don't know my passwords because iPhone just saves it for us but anyhow I remember ordering that but I'm pretty sure this is what I ordered for my nephew because it was bigger but I don't know what the heck is in this little one because I ordered two of the other thing that I'm thinking about, unless they're both in here. Oh, this came with a little crown chakra sticker. I mean, um, yeah, a little ohm sticker and then a little crown chakra um, card. And it says crown chakra sahasra rara. Element, thought, seed, sound, ohm, affirmation, I know, meaning thousandfold, gland, pituitary, colors, white and violet. Crystal de Luna store. All right, this might be, I love these little satiny bags that they put everything in. Did I order two of those little sets? And then is the crystals coming from somebody else? I'm so confused. Um, that sucks. Cause I forget what I ordered because you know. Oh, <laughs> Jackie! I forgot I ordered these. I ordered two opalite little easter egg doodad guys 
one is definitely clearer than the other. I don't know if you guys can see that. Little opalite, little, little eggs. Little eggs. I did order that for myself, so. <laughs> yes, that's what I ordered for myself right here. So the other, I love the way they package this. I'm definitely keeping, well, I always do anyway, but that was like super cute packaging. For trying a new company, I will definitely be back. I'm gonna put you in my favorites. And then this, this should be what I got for my nephew. Like, so pretty. Yes. And then they put this up in there. Little information, which you know I love my information cards. Oh, and then his has the red and the root chakra, Muladhara, element earth, seed sound, lamb, affirmation I am, meaning root support, gland adrenalines, colors red and black. And then this, his came with a little stand to um, put it on. And I don't know if I'm gonna unwrap it, unwrap it. I kinda wanna show you guys. And then wrap it up again in my own bubble wrap. <laughs> Cause I gotta make sure there's nothing wrong with it, right? I gotta make sure it's good to go. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Cause they only put it in this actually. So that will be easy to rewrap. Remember objects online are always big, uh, smaller than what they appear. But this is a gold sheen obsidian dragon and I just thought it was so badass. And then it came with this stand to hold it like so. Little clear stand too, so it kind of looks like it's just floating on your shelf from far away. But yeah, that was a good find. And that's the back, nice and smooth. Gold sheen obsidian. I was looking for an amethyst um, dragon because I figured, you know, you're the dragon, February's birthstone, but couldn't find that one. Not one. So I'm like, you know what, this will do. So I got him that. And I don't normally buy stuff like this for family members, um, but I felt the calling to do so. And the other ones must be coming in through a different company. I'm actually going to, they packaged it well too, because even in the box has bubble wrap. Like they don't play around, I'm here for it. I will definitely be a returning customer to them because you know me guys, like when you take pride in your work and you take the time to package everything nicely and make sure it's delivered to me unharmed. And I just like the little, having your logo everywhere. You know, it's all about the details. I say that in every video, it's all about the details, <laughs> which we're missing in the last two boxes I did. Are we gonna go there? Should we go there? I don't know. So we're gonna go there. So I looked up, I seen some of you saying like, oh, maybe it's because they are charging you for their um, online workbook, workshop, whatever the heck you wanna call it. So they are going live this Friday, but I think it's the same time my sister Alicia is going live. So of course I'm supporting her. Um, so if you guys ain't already, you should be following Alicia Witchcrafter. She's going live this Friday. She's been, she did it the last, I think this is gonna be her third or fourth Friday. I wanna say third. Um, doing moon journaling. And honestly, it's helped me a lot because those that follow me know, I do love shadow work, but when it comes to like sitting there and like figuring out what the hell I'm gonna write in this book, it's hard, but the prompts that she gives, I'll be honest, not all of them resonate, but there's always one. The last time I think I, I missed um, half the live because I set my alarm for freaking a.m. instead of p.m. I was so mad at myself. But when I jumped on, they were on their last prompt out of three, and the last one wasn't really resonating with me because it was like something like, oh, something like, um, 
what did you do that was outstanding or something like that. And I'm just like, mm, no, I haven't done anything good lately, like outstanding. So I was like, oh, what were the first two? And then she repeated the first two. I'm like, oh, those resonated. And then I went to town writing. So honestly, if you have trouble with um, focusing on your shadow work, I suggest you go check out her videos because they've helped me so much. And it's fun because she sets a timer and then we can talk about it afterwards and stuff. And I feel like, I don't know if it's because you get the energy from your other sisters being there or I don't know what it is, but it, it, it just helps a lot. And it's fun. It's fun. If you're, if you're here for like community and stuff, because you know I promote community and love and, you know, all that stuff. It, it's great. Like, come join us. Come check her out. Um, so, yeah, that was my first haul. Took me 20 freaking minutes, 15 minutes. I can't see that far. So let me go a little bit faster because I have a lot of shit to show you guys. I should have went live so we could just talk shit together. But, oh yeah, so anyway, back to, we're not going to name that because they don't, they don't even deserve to be named. The first box, the dragon box, I was a little upset with that box. But honestly, going back and looking at the prices, I, I didn't get my money's worth. It was still probably like a $50 value, um, maybe $60 but the i definitely got the cheapest ting Sha bells because mine are already fraying where the um where like the little leather strap is holding them together um and for five dollars more you can get ting Sha bells that have engravings on them and have they come in little pouches because i was searching my mind because i love the noise um i love <laughs> noise therapy sound therapy i'm calling it noise sound therapy um but yeah, it wasn't, it didn't blow me away. And I think I was kind of like upset that they gave me two bells. Like why give me tincture bells and a mini bell? Why couldn't you substitute that mini bell for something else? Like dragon related, um, dragon resin, like anything. I don't know. Dragon incense, anything I felt, I don't know. But that, that box was okay. Still wasn't happy about the price because I've gotten way better products for way less. Um, but then that second one yesterday, oh, it took everything in me not to, like, freak to freak out. Like, I, I was, like, after the video, I'm, like, picking up the box. I'm just, like, where's the rest of my money? Like, it wasn't in, and it's, like, it's not even in the details. Like, the sticker was blank. Didn't even have their logo on it. Um, the box was just a plain pink box. No logo or sticker or stamp. Like, nada. And it was just like, it wasn't in the package. You know what I mean? It wasn't like she spent money packaging that item because they're just, yeah, that, that was a horrible box. That, that is in my top three worst boxes ever is the one I did yesterday. Um, this is just a little planner that a budget book. Let's take this off. It actually says it right there. My little budget book so I can keep on track because I had to, um, say bye bye to a lot of boxes but then there's boxes that I love and I'm going to continue supporting them because they, they haven't done me dirty so I am going to continue supporting them so I just liked it because it has like my financial goal goals um my strategy I think I paid like seven bucks for this book on Amazon uh debt tracker it's just something like because I need to be more mindful of my money spending because you ever be like well, I got this much in the bank, it's okay. And then you go to buy a coffee and just like, where'd all my money go? <laughs> I forgot I paid that bill. So yeah, I, I need that. I'm trying to be more organized this year. So that was me trying to be more financially frugal, financially stable, financially, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, organized. <laughs> so guys i splurged i ain't gonna lie i splurged because i know i'm not gonna be able to splurge in april because then that's when like ish is going down at my job and we don't know what's going down so i'm like well usually i spoil myself in april i spoil myself now <laughs> because we don't know if we can do that in april oh they gave me a receipt oh this was the was this right no, my other free stuff must be somewhere else. So, 
my favorite and trust you guys know i get so many like allura boxes i get the um macy's beauty box before that i was getting ipsy and boxytron but we won't talk about them but out of all the moisturizers no matter if they call cost hundreds of dollars or what my favorite moisturizer that makes my skin like literally all i will do is put on this moisturizer and go to work and i get so many compliments like like i have a full set of makeup on or something but this clinique dramatically different moisturizing lotion it's god's gift so i got this every time this goes on sale at macy's i grab it because it comes with the whole thing it comes with the clinique all about the eyes for around your eyes and their products work so good they have a little facial soap um and then a makeup remover oh and this one came with a mascara and i didn't even notice that a little clinique happy perfume honestly i didn't even notice that so that mac mascara that we received in the last beauty box works really good okay because i have like no eyelashes they're blonde you can't see them i put one coat on i'm like oh wow i can see a difference but but <laughs> so take that edge off i go in the shower and i have a really good cleanser <laughs> get out of the shower and it's like all black so i'm like ooh, i need a makeup remover because yeah but it takes her a while to like come off too so i think it's like waterproof because yeah it works good so mac mascara Oh, this smells good. I already have perfume on now. This smells happy. Is that what it's called? Clinique Happy. Mmm. Smells like summertime. Like you're out with the girls. You guys are drinking wine at the vineyards. Oh, and you just smell so good and sweet. And everyone's walking by like, hey girl, what you wearing? You look good. You smell good. It's like, it's one of those perfumes. You're in your sundress and your sun hat. You having a good time with the girls? Yeah, that's what that smells like. Oh, that smells good. Clinique Happy. I've never tried that. But yeah, that is my favorite. This one right here. I'm going to take it out for you guys. Shut the front door. All right. I was going to say, <laughs> one thing I wanted. And this this will last me quite a while. Less is more. I like, like this is so good and my face gets so dry in the winter plus if i start tanning my face will get extra dry so this when it says dramatically different girls i wouldn't lie to you this is so good so check out macy's anytime it's on sale grab that ish there's also a pink one i think that says like or is it this one that i'm thinking of i think they have a pink moisturizer too that's from that i've gotten in a box and this all about the eyes reduces circles and puffs it's tiny, but powerful. This stuff too, like, and it's a little peachy color. I love the smell of their products too. It's like not chemically smelling. It smells bomb. So I got me some moisturizer because my skin was dry. And then, I don't know why it's in such a big box, but I don't know if you guys remember, I think it was way before December. I got in my Macy's beauty box. <laughs> these samples it was a men and a woman's perfume and they look like little robots and they were so freaking cute and i told you guys i was like yo if anything i just want the bottle for the, what it looks like but then it smelled so bomb so let me tell you i've been stalking until this shit goes on sale because i refuse to pay lots of money for perfume even though I only buy it like once a year because literally I'll wear that one perfume all year. I have sprays and, you know, our oils that we get. I use those too. But like for an actual perfume, I pick one favorite and that's it for the year. And it, that bitch better last me the year. Oh, this is my free stuff. Because if you spent so much, you get free stuff. Oh, Clinique. This is the one. Moisture Surge Overnight Mask. This is for the one at night. Oh, they gave me a Moisture Surge face spray too. Thirsty Skin Relief. Oh, this is all Moisture Surge. So this was the pink one I was talking about. I think if you spent so much money. Oh, this is actually a bigger bottle. This is for Auto Replenishing Hydrator. I don't know if that's, yeah, whatever. 
But this, yes, I got this in a beauty box before. Overnight mask. This is for at nighttime after you cleanse your face, you put your oil on, you put this on. You know, when I'm like a baby smooth skin. Oh my God, you're gonna thank me. You're gonna thank me. You're like, yes. And then this spray I've never used, but it says thirsty skin. My skin feeling a little thirsty right now. Let's see. Oh, I think I put too much. Ooh. It smells good too. Very late scented. Oh, that feels like refreshing. I feel like you would bring this on the beach with you. And when you know when you get really hot, you just like, spritz it on your face. Like, yes. Yes, queen. Yes, I like that. Okay. Taking care of the face. Let me. I think these were the freebies. Maybe I did purchase that. Yeah, because I want to buy this. We have Clinique. Oh, yeah, I remember per picking this. They told me to pick three. So I did pay for this. So I think I paid 20 bucks for this or 10 bucks. I think this was, these two were on clearance. It says US 20 bucks. So I either paid 20 or 10 for it. And then they let me pick three things. So I picked a Clinique. I'm guessing this is um, eyeliner, quick liner for lashes, intense, stylo, design, intense black. So I got a little eyeliner. I don't know why, but that looks freaking navy to me. But we got an eyeliner for free. We got a little Clinique. And this ain't going to go on that color. I actually have this already because I got it last year for free. I think my daughter stole it. It goes on. It gives you like a tint of color, but it's not dark like that. I actually like these for the beach because they're butter soft. They're Clinique. Um, what does it say this is? Oh, it doesn't. But it's just like a, a lip balm. Yeah, I can't remember. It's too tiny. And then I'm glad I like it because then I got a Clinique. Happy um lotion and another little spray so i can leave it in my purse oh this one's bigger and pretty that's like a the bigger is it spray or roll on it is a spray oh this smells bomb and then i got a little body cream but <laughs> what i really wanted to remove these all right do you guys add stuff to for free shipping should just like why am i gonna pay 20 dollars for shipping when i can just put more <laughs> my thing and get stuff and get it all shipped free or am I the only one because I can't I'm just like what spend 20 more dollars get free shipping or pay 30 dollars for shipping hmm, let me think about that real quick so I don't know if I'm gonna say this guy's name right or woman's name right I'm sorry it's r-a-b-a-n-n-e so I'm gonna say Raban or Rab Rabin, Rabin, but it's called Fame, is the <laughs> perfume, and the retail value is $167. I'm telling you right now, I did not pay that. <laughs> I did not pay that. I paid, I think, $109, because $100 is usually my limit, $120 is pushing it. Oh my god, but look how fucking cute she is! Oh. <gasps> But yes, this will last me all year. It's a huge bottle of perfume. And I didn't, because if you just got the perfume, I think it was like 10 or $20 more. I'm like, why would I do that when I can get that and the lotion? But guys, look how cool my robot perfume is. All fucking dressed up and cute. And it smells, it smells divine. It, it smells so freaking good. Like, if I could purchase all the samples and send them to you guys, I would so you could all smell divine. I'm kind of mad this don't have a doodad on it. You guys know how I am about doodads, but I want to see how it feels. Oh, makes my wrinkly hands not so wrinkly. Oh, and it's nice and light. Ugh. Smells so divine, guys. So divine. So, yes, that was my splurge at Macy's. And I love the container. It's so freaking cute. All right. Last but not least. <laughs> I still got unboxing to do with you guys. Half hour later. 
if you guys have stayed this long, um, drop in a, a robot emoji in the comments below. Yes, please, robot emoji. So these are things that, so what did I go there for? I forgot what I even went in there for. I know that whatever I went into Marshall's for, I did not get. <laughs> That's all I remember. Because I went in there with my mindset like, all right, I'm going to go in there. I'm going to look for this. And that's it. We got some Brazil candies. Coffee candy chews. Because they're from Brazil. And I love toffee and coffee and chews. I don't know. Oh, I can't show you guys that because that's actually for somebody on here. Then I got some butter rum caramels because I'm feeling like, you know, I don't know why. I just, I just, I just wanted some toffee caramels and apparently Brazilian one. This was at the register, by the way, because, you know, I, I just can't help myself. And they had three different kinds and that, that was, yeah. Because I don't need any more decorations, according to my husband, but it was my favorite color. Look how cute this little, and it's, it's, it's kind of heavy. It's like a little porcelain pearlesque bunny, and he was only $5.99. I say only. Only $5.99, and he's just so cute. And I'm just like, oh my god, I needed to have him. I can't go shopping guys so I can't go shopping <laughs> this I couldn't resist I already have one in the regular disco ball color but they needed a friend and it gave it purple like freaking fun guy times two like come on get it fun guy yeah so <laughs> My magic mushroom. That looks cool through there. And this one is actually, this one was $12.99 for some reason. This one's glass on the bottom and it has a tiny hole. And I'm hoping that I can put those little lights in there and like light it up and see it come up because there's like little cracks in here everywhere. And I think that would be so dope. So yeah, I'll let you guys know how that works out. But it's by Cupcakes and Cashmere at Home Decor. I couldn't freaking resist this fun guy. I mean, He's fucking cute, right? Like, they had so many mushrooms. Pink mushrooms, purple mushrooms, blue mushrooms, felt mushrooms, glass-blown mushrooms, disco mushrooms. Like, yeah, that was me in the mushroom aisle. <laughs> I was like, I want one of each. I want to take one home. <laughs> one for all my friends. I'm like, dude, if I was rich, I wouldn't really be rich because I every time I go out, I think of other people. And I would just be like, one for you, one for me. One for you, one for me. Oh, and then I went down the spice aisle. Because I needed some different spices. And their spices were cheap. $3.99 and I think $4.99. And they're glass, so I will reuse them. So I got this gourmet collection spice blend of avocado guacamole spice blend. I don't know if you guys see that. For $3.99. It was a big boy. Nice glass. And then I got kicking chicken, finger licking <laughs> spice blend. And it has salt, onion, paprika, garlic, chili, black pepper, thyme, sage, oregano, and cumin. But another nice glass jar. And honestly, this size in the market for plastic and smaller is like $7.99, $9.99. I was looking the other day, I'm like, Damn, I need to find another place to get my spices. I'm going to start making them shits. I'm going to do a whole, what do you call it? Vegetable herb garden right here. Not vegetable, herb garden right here. And the last one I got was smoked paprika, garlic, chili, and chives spice blend. And it has paprika, garlic, onion, sugar, red bell pepper, black pepper, tomato, chili, oregan, oregano, lemon peel rosemary chives and a smoked flavor so yeah that was i just went down every freaking aisle literally went down every aisle all right that i can show you because i'm just giving you guys the whole scoop about my life right now and then because i've been staring at these cobwebs at the top of my bedroom ceiling for a hot minute now and i can't reach them with my 
duster thing that I have, I got this one and it came with a stick so I can make it bigger and I can reach all the ceilings in all the world. No, and it was only like $6.99. They had one for $4.99, but it was the same size I had. It didn't come with this extra long stick for her pleasure. I mean, um, for reaching. So yeah, $6.99 and it says Chanel. A Chanel. I'm fancy. I got a Chanel duster. But it does smell, it smells, no, it feels bad soft. So I had to get that. <laughs> then, all right, please tell me I'm not the only one. Every year I feel like I buy a big freaking thing of Tupperware. And then I have no Tupperware. Or I have like two bowls left and like 15 freaking covers or vice versa. But never, no, I have no bowls. So they had these, they're BPA free, um, freezer safe, microwave safe. Not that I put shit in the microwave. But there is seven containers, seven lids, and it was only $7.99, and I liked the colors. <laughs> and as long as it's BPA-free, I'm good with that. So, yeah, I got me some Tupperware. See, I got some household things, things I needed for the house. I got everyone a set of sheets. I got this one for my youngest from London, from somewhere. Yeah, London K. Yeah, londonk.com. I got these pretty purple ones, $16.99 for the flat sheet, the fitted sheet, and two pillowcases. They all come with a flat fitted and two pillowcases. And then because my room's like a dark blue, I seen, I'm not gonna lie, I seen these really like 70s looking sheets that had all different kind of mushrooms and like flowers all over them, but like, like that kind of style. And I had them in my hand. But then I read what they were made out of. It was like polyester. And I'm like, mm, I don't like that feeling on my skin. <laughs> but they were so cute. But then these caught my eye. And um, they're made with all organic materials. They're made green. And um, it matched my room. Because my room is a dark blue. And it's dragonflies. My fave. So I got this uh, sheet set from Cynthia Raleigh, New York. For me. And that was only 20 bucks. And the regular is like $30 for that one. And then last but not least, I got my oldest, this one. They're obsessed with, um, what do you call it? Bugs, VWs. And this one was, um, how much was this one? Oh, this one was $19.99 too, four piece set. Just a cute little checkered set. It reminds me of LV for some reason. But yeah, that was my little haul that I did this morning. Um, while I was supposed to be home doing laundry, that's what I was doing. I was having fun at Marshall's being like, I need these spices. I ain't leaving without you. I wasn't leaving without you. You came up with me. You knew it. You knew it. We saw each other. We made eye contact. It was like, yeah. I was like, yeah. I was like, come on. Just like that. That's what happened. Um, so yeah, that was my haul. Um, I don't know, like I said, I don't know if I'm going to keep the name Stacy Side Notes. I mean, Sassy Side Notes. I don't even know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm doing with my arms. I'm sorry. I'm feeling, I need to get up and do something. Um, whatever. This was just, um, just, just me, just, just here with you talking ish, showing you things that I bought that I don't necessarily need. I mean, I needed that perfume though and the moisturizer because <laughs> your girl's face was dry and your girl needs, you need to treat yourself. You have to have at least one good perfume. I don't care what they say. You need one expensive perfume on your boudoir. So when you go somewhere fancy, even if you don't, when you just leave the house, you must smell like, mm, you know, when you smell good, you feel good, you look good, all that. So yeah, and I will be back with some unboxings. And then I also have a, um, this is gonna go on the regular channel, but <laughs> I'm gonna start my um, fitness journey for um, the members channel, which like I said, it's not gonna be like serious. Um, I'm really funny. <laughs> looking no um that too so I'm really fun to work out with like my Helda would tell you, you know, when he was down here we used to go to the gym all the time we would laugh a lot and I was like we're still burning calories <laughs> but yeah we always had fun at the gym um 
I think the only time I've ever had a serious gym experience is when I went with my brother to those hit classes because there was no freaking time to make jokes or make snide remarks or anything because you literally couldn't fucking breathe for like the whole half hour 45 minutes that class went on you were just like oh, okay, did I see? okay i got this oh, okay we're going yeah i got this oh i'm not gonna die oh i think i might die so yeah those those classes were fun they taught me a lot though and i i will use those in my future videos because i was a little advanced so we're gonna start off slow slow get into groove things you know I don't know. I'm doing a lot of hand movements today. I don't know what's going on. I'm like, I don't know. So yeah, I'm gonna let you guys go because it's been 40 minutes and I'm just rambling about nonsense now. So if you guys leave a robot emoji before and then maybe like one of these guys, one of these guys with your robot emoji, if you lasted this long, do all the emojis. All right, I'm weird now. Okay, I'm going. Love you all. Peace, love, stay sassy. Bye.